you are new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button to get instant notification. And maybe this is too much, but please also follow me on my Instagram account. Let's make this topic simple. Today we're gonna talk about the fifth fruit of the Holy Spirit, gentleness. Christotus is the Greek word of which portrays the thought of being easy and mellow, and the Hebrew counterpart of it is the word shesed, which translates to kindness and loving kindness. By the way, please correct me if I mispronounce any words. Thank you! According to Psalm 63 verse 3, Because your loving kindness is better than life, my lips shall praise. The question arises, who can be a recipient of God's loving kindness? The key is found in Psalms 107 verses 42 to 43, where it says, The righteous shall see it, and rejoice, and all iniquity shall stop its mouth. Whoever is wise will observe these things, and they will understand the loving kindness of the Lord. Those who are righteous and wise receive God's loving kindness. And you know what? It is worked out in their character too. In a very real way, all the fruits of the Spirit depend upon righteousness. Therefore, the fruits of the Holy Spirit cannot be developed in the life of one who is walking in unrighteousness. A gentle reminder, despite how cruel the world is, please remain gentle and kind. I'm not saying I never lost my temper, but through Jesus, let's make it more manageable. Alright? And to wrap it up, according to the book All About the Holy Spirit by Dr. Brian Bailey, the gentleness in our lives puts people at ease when they come into our presence and makes them feel comfortable. This is how we feel when we come into the presence of the Lord because He is the epitome of gentleness. <laughs>